guys, what's up? This is Nick Hugo from Dope Motions, and welcome to my third tutorial. Today, I'll be showing you how to create a cool transition into After Effects. So, let's just get started. First of all, go into After Effects and create a new composition. So, I have already created one and I have added two, this, two videos right here. You can see the lower one and the above one. So, first of all, Go to composition and uh, first of all I'm gonna create a new composition and I'll keep it about two seconds long. Yep. And I'll just name it Luma Buzz because that's the transition. Oh I typed it wrong, but who cares? So first of all right click, go to new and add a solid. I'll keep it white and make it comp size. Okay then what we're gonna do is create a new solid again and make the height to about 300 and make it black and hit ok then hit P on the keyboard for the position properties I'll go right maybe I'll see uh, all the way up and hit on the stopwatch create a keyframe go to about I'll go to about one second and bring it all the way down now this transition is all about solids we're gonna create a lot of solids so first we're done with it then what I'm gonna do is create a new solid again I'll keep it 200 let it be black and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make it start from right there hit P for the position properties I'll make it go all the way up the same thing we have to do again but from another time level and I'll bring it all the way down again the same thing okay so now what we're gonna do is create again a new solid but this time I'm gonna create it white okay hit P for the position properties again and I'll see I'll come right about there and I'll make it all the way down then click on the stopwatch go to right there I'll go to right about there and bring it up all the way out of the frame like right there okay so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do the same thing but horizontally so create a new solid again I'll keep it um, let's see black and I'll change this to about 150 you can keep whatever you want but I like it and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit R on the keyboard to rota rotate it make it 90 degrees and ok yep so now again hit P for the position properties I'll go randomly you can go anywhere and I'll just bring it out of the comp right there just pre out yep hit on the stopwatch I'll go right about there and there and I'll bring it up all the way through the comp right there now I'm gonna duplicate it by control D and misplace it right there or I'll just misplace it forward so it will be like there it's not looking good so I'll just misplace it more so that we can see right there yep looks good so half of way through so let's get back into a comp where we had two videos so now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add this Luma comb which we made and made it right about there I'll add it right about there and then you have to make sure that the lower video is like right about till the Luma comp is there so you can see we have this comp right there so, but we can't see anything so what we're gonna do is toggle switches and change this to Luma inverted so now what we have is this cool I'll just render it pretty quick so that you guys can see it there we go we have the cool transition now my PC is a little slower so the render is taking a little time but you get it what we have guys done it you can see this cool transition right there yep yep so that's it I hope you learned something new today 
and see you guys next time I hope you like my first two tutorials which I made any comments you have on this tutorial the most welcome so I'm checking it out so thanks for watching guys